Today I'm visiting Our Ladies College at Annerley for a Fast Five with Dr Doug and it's my great honour to welcome Andre Rice to Brisbane Catholic Education as the 2022 Principal. Andre, welcome to Brisbane Catholic Education. I'm delighted that you've joined us and today thank you for agreeing to a Fast Five with me. The first question I want to know is Tell us about what you're excited about in being principal of Our Ladies and joining BCE. Doug, I'm most excited to be working in a school with incredibly passionate and loyal students and staff. Not a day goes by when someone hand on heart doesn't stop me and tell me this is the most amazing school. In terms of BCE, I'm really happy to be so well supported by BCE as a system it's obviously got great collective wisdom, corporate knowledge and best practice policies and procedures which will really help me in this new role. Well, thank you. We've got a lot to live up to on that. So, uh, Andre, I'm also interested to know what can parents expect from you? Doug, they can expect a school that is going to support and challenge their daughters. I strongly believe that young women do best when they feel at home and secure in their school environment and that they're then ready to be extended and challenged to be the very best version of themselves they can be. That, that's a, a wonderful aspiration as a principal but we know that principal, the, the work and the role of a principal is very challenging and, and schools are challenging places. What are some of the challenges you'd expect to find and see in a, in a modern high school like Our Ladies? Doug, I think my, one of my biggest challenge is going to be balancing tradition and continuity with innovation and a real forward future push. So I'm going to do that by keeping a clear line of sight with where we've come from but with my eyes firmly fixed on where we want to get to. Right, you're an experienced educator, had a, a wonderful experience within Queensland and across Australia. I'm just interested, really interested in your take on where are the opportunities for education moving forward? Doug, there's two areas I'd like to comment on there. So the first one is this real movement we're going to see towards personalising the learning experience and I guess curating it for each student because I think there's still many students that school doesn't quite hit the mark. They don't feel it's relevant or meaningful enough for them. So that is an area I'm really interested in and I think we're going to see great focus on. Mm -hmm. The other area I'm really passionate about is that idea of global citizenship. So using our schools to be forming young people who are going to be analysts, advocates and actors to create a more just and equitable world. Wow. Now no doubt you're going to be very busy in your role as Principal of Our Ladies College at Annerley, but when you're not working, what do you like to do? Doug, I'm a terrible jogger. I am last in every little jogging group. <laughs> I'm falling off the streets of the suburb I live in, but I do that to keep sane. I enjoy the company of my three adult sons who are a great yang to the yin of working in an all-girls school. And I love to keep close to my friends and community on the Tiwi Islands in the Northern Territory. Andre Rice, thank you very much for participating in a Fast Five with Dr Doug.